Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Thief 2X, Shadows of the Middle Age. I'm Kamchak Fisco. Come join me for a sneaksy adventure. Alright, let's finish searching this building, and we'll figure out where the sewer goes. More heelsy fruits from the goodsy woodsy lord, who's dead. Ooh, another gas arrows. So now we have three of them. Very handy. He must be upstairs. Yep, he's right there, actually. I was going to say, he has to be upstairs, because I hear him, but I don't see him. What do we have here? And the word of the builder came to me, saying, Son of the forge, the order of thy ways has become a dross unto me. As men gather silver, bronze, iron, lead, and tin into the midst of the furnace to blow fire on it, so shall I gather my children to test them for a time. For one who is you, yet not of you, shall rise from the flames to be father of the fatherless, a husband to the widow, and a son to the childless. For the sloth of the hammer doth max great, does wax greatly, and my anger will not be quenched, lest this one rule for a time, and that those who call upon my name might remember me in their time of trial, and call to me in the day of their despair. Then I shall hear their voice, and shall deliver them from the hands that trust in the gear, and forsake the wonders of the hammer and simplicity of the nail. Excerpt from the discernment of Zabal. So it sounds like they knew that a false prophet would rise. But for whatever reason, Karis didn't care because he was an egomaniacal maniac that wanted to rise to power. And the builder upholds all who fall and raises up all who are bowed down. And the eyes of all look expectantly to you. And you give them their work in due season. You open your hand and satisfy, satisfy the desire of every man who drives the nail. Psalms of the Builder, 145.14. Mm-hmm. Any hidden books that, like, I missed last time because I wasn't looking and I had to go back and play the level again? Okay, what's with this fancy-ass room? Right then. Well, talk about your excess. They really need golden goblets? I don't think so. Okay, that puts us up to 500. We're getting here, slowly but surely. This is all tile. That's gonna suck. Wait, is the outset wood? Okay, that, that works, actually. Okay, I'm gonna have to extinguish these things. That was nothing. It's a figment of your imagination. Quit being so jumpy. Tis pagan sorcery to... Oh, come on. Tis pagan sorcery to fall victim to such noise. That's one. Or on the other side, get the other one, and this time actually get the other one, as opposed to miss. I don't know what that nonsense was. Nonsense, I see. What was that I heard? Okay, I shot the thing dead on. What the heck? That's weird. Wow, I went right over it, so that didn't help. Sunny port. <laughs> That's a fire arrow. Let's, let's not shoot that. Apparently that is unextinguishable. Good to know. Kind of annoying, but good to know. The banners are freaking out again, man. Okay, can I zip by the window? Well, it's quiet now. Tis always quiet. The tricks to a death play is ears. Play tricks on your ears. Play ears on your tricks is what I almost said. That would have been a disturbing mental image. Glad I finished that dog. Okay, can we extinguish... Not the fire air! Stop selecting that. Can we extinguish these? Shit, that was too high. I hope these can be extinguished, because we got to get up there. Perfect. 
Now we just gotta zip past the lit, lit torch of evilness. At least there's carpeted area here. What was that? The oh, that was close. Is he gonna go? Okay, good. Sweet. Okay, grab him, stash him over here. Oh, there's another one. Shit. Good night. Okay, problem solved. Stash you in the shadows with your friends. Bless these banisters, which is what I was going to do in the first place. Huh? Okay, so what the hell's up here? That would be Cavador's chambers. Yeah! Stop hitting yourself with the door, stupid. That's a hell of a view, but I don't see how that helps. Well, that is one hell of a view. Anyway, okay, so we'll go up last, because... That's the mission objective. So let's poke around and see what we can find. Good night, Hammer Mage. Rest well in the builder's arms of slumber and solace. I don't know, I'm making this shit up. Okay. Two, we're at 540. This is going to take forever. 580. What do we have here? Thus says the Builder, be not afraid of the words which you have heard, of those who would seek to destroy the way of the hammer, for they have surely, for they have blasphemed me, and surely I shall bring calamity upon their number. I will cause them to fall by their own hand. Incline thine ears to the Builder's words. Keep, thine, keep thy way pure before me, and I shall prove my faithfulness, for I am thy sword and thy great reward. Lekiesel? 14, 32 through 34. Interesting. So downstairs should be done. It's just a matter of finishing this whole upstairs area. For the Theodore. Silver. 590. Something up here. Oh, somebody's stashing away the gold. 620. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. Brother Marcus. Well, Marcus, you do not seem to be in deep enough slumber. Let me help you with that. <coughs> now you're in a deeper slumber. You'll be fine. Well, we hit our money a little bit at 650, but I'm willing to bet there's enough gold to go over that. There almost always is. Brother Davis. Or Davis. I'm not sure which one. Whoa. Hi. <coughs> that worked. I thought I was going to hit the lamp. Not sure why he was standing in the corner staring at his lamp, but okay. He's taking a nap now. Uh -huh. Keeping a stash of your own personal loot, are you? That is not the way of the hammer. Let me relieve you of such goodies. Fourth day of the third month. How is it that the individuals can be so cruel? How can they not understand the ramifications of their small actions? And yet, surely I have made grievous errors as well. So small in my mind, so grand in their action. Have I not been of service? Have I not given everything of myself that I could? I feel nothing but cold emptiness for our hallowed leader, and he would not persecute that reprehensible baker's assistant who spiked my bread with spice. Is, com is beyond comprehension. Now I must live with this addiction. A torment I would never have known had it not... had not... Had that damned boy not perpetrated such a foul prank, and the bishop's nephew no less, had he been the, rela the relation of anyone else, how could I place my love and trust in an institution so easily manipulated? I cannot! I will not! But my love for the builder is strong, and I will not leave his service, wailing like a spoiled child. Really? Because it sounds like you want to. I hope my meeting with these new mechanists next week proves fruitful. Heretic! Perhaps they can provide me with the comfort I seek. Perhaps they can aid me in recovering the wonder and burning commitment I felt all those years ago. Uh-huh. Crazy person. You're gonna go from one fanatical group to the next. Yeah, I'm sure that'll trade up well for you. So we got Cavador's 
So there must be two ways in, then. Okay, there's nothing in the tub, just making sure. No water arrows in there. So let's check out Cavador's room. These must be Cavador's quarters. Yeah, you could say that. Interesting, the words of Karis. Almost hear the words of Karis. My eyes have seen the vision of the Builder's will. The breaking of the Metal Dawn. Why would not the Builder use all manner of tool and trade to shape his people? Is the Builder so small that his hand is only upon the hammer of our forebearers? The Builder hath created man with the ability to wield not only the mallet, but also the pen, not just the hammer, but the gear. Is the Builder a lesser man than his own children? Are we not created in his image to follow in his ways? How creative the works of the Builder appear in my, to my eyes. He uses all manner of men and all manner of tool to accomplish his purpose. He conforms all to his will. Why then will we be ashamed to do the same? Nay, brothers, we should be ashamed if we fail to do likewise. Do not all men belong to the Builder? Does not the metal and the very soil from which it comes bear the mark of his great artistry? Why then, my brothers, do we bind ourselves to a tradition of the hammer, when the Builder has set no such bond upon us? Why do we shun the use of any hammer or manner of man, when the Builder has seen fit to use any man to his own glorious end? We must loose ourselves from the shackles of the past, from our own narrowness and hypocrisy to take up new ways. I have touched the tools of the Builder, gear, steam, flame, earth, hammer, and yes, the cog but none to the exclusion of the other. We must join together the bounty of his provisions to each hire for the sake of the Builder's glory and for the sake of this glorious calling he has placed upon each of us. Mm-hmm. More fanatical rentings of a soon-to-be-dead man. I feel as if two paths stretch out before me. I have finally met with controversial Brother Cass. I, do, I will dare to call him brother here in my writings, for I see in his eyes and hear in his words the same devotion to the builder that fuels my heart. As I stood shivering in the cold, for Quartermaster Samuel has yet to be found, Kara spoke of the new writings of the master builder, his own vision for the future of those who would follow, and a new, and a new order. One second. Sorry guys, I'm recording and it's kind of late. I'm alternating between coughing and yawning. Which undoubtedly surpassed the glory of the Hammerettes. Despite the winter air, I have inv I was enveloped in the warmth of the Builder as Karis spoke of the marine project, the Cetus Amicus. He so called it. He has been observing my career from afar and has somehow gained knowledge of my experience in such areas. I am almost suspicious that he has been reading this journal and is aware of my doubts and fears. How different from my current leaders. Okay, that is the sentence. Alright, I thought I read it wrong. This man is a visionary, not bogged down in the tradition and legalistic jargon which only served to complicate the plan of the Builder. I have given no answer as yet, for such a decision cannot be made lightly, nor with coronal concerns. I would lose many friends over such a drastic defection. Still, I stand to gain so much more in the Mechanist Order, yet another, yet another decision to make. Quartermaster Samuel's family came to claim his body today. Such a tragedy. He was a faithful brother who served our mission well. I am perplexed as to how he met his demise. Because you don't realize people are trying to kill you. Again, the Builder seems to lay obstacles in my path. Issues to consider. Samuel will be hard to replace, and I have a little heart to seek another quartermaster. Perhaps it is not. It, perhaps it shall not be my burden to bear if I forsake this calling to follow Karis. Onam has yet to return from the mausoleum, and I fear the worst. It is now. It has been now three weeks, and the last of our order did, to venture there did so less than a generation ago. Many of those brothers left the service of the builder, their faith shaken to the core. Whether the orb will be of any aid to the failing hammer order, I know not. But I wish no ill towards Brother Onam. Despite his recent behavior, he is a faithful servant to the Builder, and should be rewarded for his courage and tenacity in the matter. In this matter, my new found hope in the teachings of Karis give me pause concerning the orb. If Onam is successful in recovering the artifact, I will not turn it over to the Hammerites to use against the Brother Karis. Better it remain in the depths of those tombs than become a weapon in the coming battle between the Builder's children. Well, that's not going to happen. Oh, that's where I put the, the letter. Duh. I was wondering what was highlightable. Brother Cavador, Brother in Arms, Malcolm. 
Brother Cavador, several mechanist heretics have been spied in downtown Sunnyport. Tis no secret that they control that blasphemous steam carriage the town council approved, but thus far we have kept them from venturing further into the town. I remind you also that Inquisitor Dibbler interrogated young William, the pastry boy, several weeks ago when he was caught eavesdropping on private conversation to the brother Odom's office. The Inquisitor was unable to extract any useful, useful information from him before he treacher his treacherous throat was cut. Well, damn, he was a kid! Though the boy did mention something about the ways of Karis. I fear this does not bode well, nor dare I guess the intentions of these mechanists. But twill be nigh impossible to contain such wrath of our eager young acolytes against such apostates. Tis been many years since passed since the vile smuggling ring was driven from the underbelly of this town. And thus the hammers of our zealous brothers do grow thirsty for the blood of blasphemers and heretics. Give the word and full inquiries will be conducted upon anyone suspected of hammer having is suspected to have mechanist sympathies. Brother in arms, Malcolm. That's not crazy at all. That's known for Malik. We don't want to put that on the table. That would be really bad. Hold on. Time to get the hell out of here. Nobody saw nothing. Now that everybody's unconscious, it should be a quick breeze to get the hell out of here. First, however, we gotta go downstairs and check where this other area went. It's the only place we haven't been. I'm hoping it's a quick way back, but it might just be a different area, so let's find out. Oh yeah, it's a quick way back. That works. Perfect. Okay, so we just hop over here, get back into the sewers, climb back out, and we're golden. So, the Burke of Legend has been slain. The Mechanist Intrusion has been stopped. The Hammer Order now has a new target of the Smuggler Ring. All in all, a good day's work. Not to mention the fact that we looted the place clean, I hope. Or at least got most of it, I hope. 725. That better be close to everything, man, because I couldn't find anything else. And if I go back and edit these and I find more loot than I missed, I'm going to feel like such an idiot. Right, forgot about the zombie hiding in there. You know, I'm almost tempted to banish him just to do the city a favor. Yeah, what the hell, why not? Let's see if you're real, Mr. Zombie. Well, yeah, that's not going to work if you shoot it into the water, stupid. Uh... Hey, hey, are you real? Hey, hey, Mr. Zombie, are you real? Hey, hey, are you real? Hey, are you real? Okay, he's not real. Just checking. I'm actually kind of surprised he didn't get up and try to kill me. <laughs> Back into the water we go. Back out, out, out to the city. Or at least to Sunnyport. Technically, we're not in the city. We're in, like, some suburb or something. Some village on the outskirts of the town or just outside of the town. Mm. Evil ladders of evilness. Let me out of the water. Okay. And we're clear. So now we just gotta get all the way back to our room. What the... Who... Where'd you come from? Hey, what's that? <laughs> no, seriously, bro. Where'd you come from? I thought I... Whoa. <clears throat> what did... Were these the two I knocked unconscious what's before? That? <laughs> No. Okay, they have been magically replaced by other hammers. Freaky. But we're going to head home, so the hell with that. So we get to knock out a couple more people, yay. Steam. Always with the steam. Okay. So we're close, just got to go upstairs, zip across the way, jump over to our window, and ta-da! All done. All in a day's work. Night's work. Whatever. Whatever time it that doth it, it is. Okay, save real quick, just in case. Ba -da! Ba -ba -da! Okay. What did we get? <laughs> I never find the damn loot. There's three secrets, that's why. Okay. I actually did get an airborne knockout. Cool.
Thanks for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. I really appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoy them. You all take care of yourselves, and if you want to see more of me, go over the video on the list, or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below, and please remember to tag that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well, everyone.